Hello and welcome to Michael's Homes HD, Prince Edward Island's number one source for high definition real estate video. So down this very quiet and it's secluded country road that's fully paved, we're going to turn right onto McLaren Road. As you can see in front of us is world famous Greenwich. It's the newest Canadian national park and it's famous for mobile parabolic sand dunes which from what I've been told, there's only three sets of them in the entire planet, and they move. If you ever have an opportunity to check out Greenwich, I strongly suggest, recommend that you do. Uh, it's not uh, very well marketed because they're trying to keep it in its natural form. Uh, as in addition to the beach, there is a um, interpretive center that you can watch movies about the area. Apparently there's all kinds of uh, history and burial grounds and stuff uh, around Greenwich in this area. There's quite the history. Uh, we're just turning right into the subject property. The property is configured like an L, so this is sort of behind uh, the neighbor's property. And then the property on the right would be owned by you. This house would be owned by you. We have a historic house, so I'm going to do a write-up about it. And we're just going to go down here to the end of the field. And we're going to show you where you could build the most magnificent Prince Edward Island escape or estate property. So you've got over 61 acres. And currently it's being farmed to keep the road in good condition. You would own property across the street as well to protect your views so no one can build across the street. So this harvest will probably be coming out of the ground soon. The uh, farmer was nice enough to cut this little pathway for us. So at about that hedgerow would be the eastern boundary of the property. Behind there you can see a bit of a, uh, a fence line. If you had horses, you wanted to build a, a little cottage or a massive luxury home, this would be just awesome. No one would ever know you are down here. So at the, the one, end of the one field, we have uh, some woodlands here to the left. And then we're going to carry on. This is a very, very long drive. So the woods, we got birch. We've got uh, softwood, usual PEI forest. We've got raspberries in the property. I think I saw some apple trees. And then here we go, another massive field. I hope you can see that. And then where those trees are at the end, that's not the end of the property yet. And we are gonna attempt to get down to the beach from here. I'm not sure if I'll be able to do it. Apparently it's growing in, but we did have some preliminary uh, work done. We have arrived. According to my GPS, we've got uh, a little bit of a buffer there. McLaren Road is to my left, so I can see it on the GPS going right down to the shore. So we can't drive through here, but we're going to attempt to walk. And away we go. May not be the smoothest production, but it should give you the uh, point. What we're looking at here, this could all be cut back and bush cut. Doesn't look like it's been accessed in a while. Other than our recent cutting. Yeah. 
Yes, yeah, so I think it would make more sense to take to the sky. Okay, we have takeoff. And up we go. So I'm not sure if I'll be able to see that uh, path I walked down. Now you can sort of see it there. So we must have walked up to about halfway. So that's just approaching the beach. We must have stopped about there. And there is a trail that goes down there. As we can see in the middle. And to the left, if we just stop here for a minute, that would be McLaren Road. And in the way in the distance, actually not that far, we can see Greenwich. If you're interested in Greenwich, just go to my YouTube channel and type in Greenwich. There's all kinds of videos. So back to the beach. If we're going to be able to take a quicker, closer look at it. There we go. This certainly beats climbing through the bush. But that's just an afternoon project to get that cleaned up. And how about this? How's that for beach? And other than that one guy that showed up today, you usually see nobody.